I'm Bambi Francisco with this segment of Lessons for Entrepreneurs, and I'm speaking with Nat Verzina. He is the co-founder of Zobni. Nat, thanks for joining us. Thank you. Well, this is your first time as an entrepreneur, and you've been an entrepreneur now for about for a couple of years. So yeah. I'm sure you've learning you've learned some lessons. Yeah. So, um, share with us at least one. Um, I think one important thing that we did early on is we recognized that being our first time, we needed to surround ourselves with really um, good people who've experienced stuff in the past. So mm -hmm. from the beginning, we, you know, our initial investment was from Paul Graham, who was a really successful entrepreneur, started a group called Y Combinator, and they did our initial funding, and they had the relationships that helped us kind of branch out to the next level. After that, we brought in uh, experience in our specific domain. We're an email software company, and we brought in, for example, the guy who made Gmail inside Google, the 20th employee at Google. Uh, to give us an idea about you know that specific domain. Moving forward from there, when we raised our Series A, we went out and said we want the best people that can help this company grow that have built billion dollar companies in the past. And so Vinod Kosla, the founder of Sun Microsystems, the um, great VC from Kleiner Perkins ended up funding our company. Maybe a little bit more expensive capital than we've gotten from maybe a less lesser recognized uh, VC, but um, you know he could put us down in a meeting with uh, you know the the CEO of GE or um, yeah. you know the founder of Netscape or whatever we need and those kind of connections that experience is really powerful so I think that's a really important thing that we've done okay surround yourself with really smart people or well connected yeah. people yeah. okay well so far so good do you have anything else uh, actually most of my lessons are about people so people are the most challenging uh, thing both uh, you know to kind of deal with the relationships but they're also the most valuable thing mm -hmm. um, one thing that we've also learned is that you really need to you know, be able to separate yourself from certain roles in the company and learn how to delegate those. I always say one of the best hires we made was, was our fifth hire. I was actually my office manager. And because from the beginning I was doing everything. I was faxing documents, dealing with HR issues, doing payroll. And I was able to pass these off to her and it let me focus on what I was really good at, which is building products and, you know, making something people want and making sure people know about it. I say that's my core competency. And so the things that don't fit into that have been able to find people to fill those gaps. And trust them. And trust them, yeah. So, okay. Well, it looks like you're doing pretty well your first time around it. It's going pretty well. Okay. Thanks for sharing that. Yeah. I've been speaking with Matt Brzezina. He's a co-founder of Zobni. I'm Bambi Francisco.